Hey YouTube people, are you running Windows 7 or Windows 8 and you keep getting this message that pops up on your screen and you can't get rid of it? Windows 10 is coming soon. Your only option over there is to click reserve. You can't get rid of this thing. It keeps popping up no matter what you do. Let me show you. It also shows up in the taskbar. You can see it's also in the taskbar. There it is over there. Get Windows 10. So you really can't get rid of this no matter what you do. Uh, when you click on it, you end up getting this advertisement. How do I get Windows 10? There, reserve your copy, install it. There is absolutely nothing you can do to get rid of it until watching this video. So I'm going to show you what you need to do. The first thing you have to do is you want to go over to your start menu and the uh, start button, the Windows button in the bottom left. And then you want to click on control panel. So we'll click on control panel. And then we get this box that comes up. It just says uh, adjust your computer settings at the top. But it's the uh, first thing that comes up when you go in your control panel. And you want to click on uninstall program under the programs thing over here. And then what you need to do is, if you look at your list, you're not going to see anything in there. You're not going to see any, any of what you need to remove. So what you have to do is right over here, it says View Installed Updates. And so this is one of the easiest ways to do it. You click on View Installed Updates, and you're going to get a list of everything that has been installed on your PC. So I'm going to go in the corner over here and enlarge that. So it takes up the whole screen. And then what I'm going to do is go up and do a search on updates, which is going to be done in the upper right-hand corner over here. You see where it says search for updates? So I'm going to click on that, and then I'm going to type in KB30355. So let me type that in now. You should see that I just typed that in. Now I'm going to click the Enter key on the keyboard. And what do we have here? Update for Microsoft. There it is, right over there. And this is what the problem is. It was installed a couple days ago. And this is the update that Microsoft put in Microsoft Updates that is geared towards Windows 7, 7 Windows 8, Windows 8.1 machines. Uh, some people on XP are getting it. But what you do is you click on this thing over here and then right click with the mouse, click your right button and then left click uninstall. Are you sure you want to un uninstall it? I'm going to click yes and then Microsoft uh, Updates is going to uninstall this thing. So we'll just wait for that to happen. While it's happening, please go to my uh, main channel page and click on donate to this uh, channel to keep supporting my efforts to bring you awesome videos. Do a thumbs up, a subscribe, a like, or whatever you do here, and feel free to link all my videos to all your cool websites if you like them, and thanks for watching. Okay, the thing is almost done. After it's done, you're going to have to restart the machine, so I'm going to restart it, but I just want to show you down in the bottom, you can still see there's that Windows 10 over there, and time to reboot. You can see that Microsoft... Uh, Windows, after I rebooted, it's going in there and fixing everything up. So now I'm going to log on to the machine. One thing that's really important about this, this is going to keep showing up over and over no matter what. The only way to avoid that is you need to take your Windows updates, disable the automatic update and install, and set it to a manual update and install. And that way, when you get your list of updates, you're going to come up with that KB3035583. And you need to click on that saying, don't install. And when it comes up for an install again, do not ask me. After you've disabled that one uh, install, then you should be able to go back to automatic settings and everything should be fine. You can see down on the bottom, that icon is, can I get this? The icon is gone. The Windows 10 update icon is gone. And that is how you disable Windows 10 from annoying you for the rest of your life.
and write this down, KB3035583. Hopefully this helped you. Now that I've disabled it, I'm doing a check for updates uh, so that I can do what I just told you. Try to get that uh, update and disable it so next time automatic updates happen, I won't get that thing installed automatically. So give this a minute and I'll show you what you need to do. I did a manual check for updates and I got an error so I had to redo it again. This time it shows that two updates are available. Let's click and see what I am offered. Two updates are available. One of them is the one that I just deleted. Let me zoom in on here so that you can see it. That's the KB3035583 right over there. That's the one that I don't want. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to check the one that I do want and I'm going to uncheck the one that I don't want and it should give me an option to say don't ask me again. I'm going to right click that. See what I just did? Okay, I'm highlighting this. I'm going to right click it. Hide update. And hopefully it says do you not want to install this again. Hide update. And it doesn't say that. It didn't even hide it. Unbelievable. That, that should work so that you don't get that again. I'm going to click on install one update and that should take care of the problem. One update, install. I shouldn't see that. You shouldn't see that update again because it's hidden from uh, update and from you seeing it. And if that does happen again, then just go back in there and uninstall it and you should be able to avoid the problem. Okay, that's the end of this video.